Hello, my name is Dr. Andrew Fink. I'm one of the surgeons here at Asuta Optic. I've been performing laser vision correction procedures for nearly 25 years now. Uh, at Asuta, we, we achieve excellent results. We have excellent technology. There are two techniques in laser vision correction. One is where the laser is aimed at the surface of the eye, and one is where the laser beam is aimed underneath the surface of the eye. The surface treatment is called TransPRK. It's a very simple procedure. You receive anaesthetic drops, go into the laser room, lie down. I put a little clip in the eye to keep the eye open and the patient just looks straight uh, towards the, the green flashing light, which is what aims the, uh, the direction of gaze. Um, the patient, the treatment doesn't hurt at all and the patient goes home immediately afterwards with a contact lens in, the, in his eyes or her eyes. Um, the first two or three days the vision is, is not so good and the eyes can be painful but usually by the fourth fifth day the patient starts to reach functional vision and the vision in, improves to 100% over the next two to three months. The second treatment is called uh, LASIK or Z-LASIK. We aim the treatment underneath the surface of the eye which means that the, the first part of the procedure is with a, a laser beam which separates a very very thin surface layer which can be moved to the side. On the surface of which is exposed underneath we perform the laser to remove the prescription, glasses prescription and then that that uh, corneal flap as it's called is put back into position. Um, the big advantage of this technique is the treatment is underneath this corneal flap or this cover and the, and the healing is very quick. Within a few hours already the patient is starting to see well. Um, both procedures are extremely safe. Even pilots in the Air Force these days are given the opportunity to do laser vision correction. Um, but there's no procedure without any possibility of side effects at all. The commonest side effects we see is dry eyes. Um, sometimes the patients have some glare and halo at night during the first few months. Um, and various other uh, things will be discussed at the time of consultation, so you're absolutely confident about your decision. Um, we have a very high success rate. If we don't think there's going to be a high success rate, we don't do the procedure. So you can be very uh, confident um, that things are going to go well if you're given the approval that you're suitable for laser. Anyway, I wish you the best of luck and hope to see you again.